All day, money, power, respect, three the hard way. What up, world? What up, world? Welcome back to Three the Hard Way TV. You already know what it is. I got my co-host Dion in the building. Hey, what's up to the people? Ladies, y'all know who I am already. <laughs> I got my man Boo Watson back in the building. What's up? Trayway. Trayway, you have. <laughs> His man is Takashi. I got my boy Jeff coming from the dungeon. Tell him what's up, Jeff. What up, ladies? And then I got my man, the only guy that I know with a fans only, my boy Ken. Tell the ladies what's up, Ken. Ladies, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> hey, he Jeff, we can barely see your face. Oh, he on my that, fault. He on there with his sexy voice. So tonight, hey, I got a question for y'all. Somebody wrote in and asked me, you know what I'm saying? They told me that. They always on Facebook and they see young ladies that they like and they be looking sexy and they don't know how to get in contact with them. So they said they hop in the inbox. He told, he asked me, he said, do I think that's some thirsty? So I'm asking y'all, is it thirsty for a dudes to hop in inboxes of chicks they don't know? Hey, okay. I'm going to go first. And, and, and this is my answer. Aquafina. <laughs> the Sandy. Ice Mountain, Fiji <laughs> water, thirsty than a motherfucker. You know what I mean? <laughs> 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 Yo, says fuck you see him, man. Says thirsty. Yeah. Hey, hey bro. Hey, I, hey, I, I, had, I had some chicks jump in my inbox. Bro, the inbox me some stuff. I got some titties. I got some titties pictures right now, man. My father just sent me. They started back yeah. watching the show, so they sent me some titties. Let me show y'all real quick. Nah, don't show us. <laughs> nah, don't show us. <laughs> no. Moving what's on. Girl went to, what's your girl went to the store? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's yeah. right here. She, she, he gave her them Tylenol PM. Knocked her out. Right. Hey, hey, my boy Ken. Yo. What, what you think? Hopping in the inbox, is that thirsty or is that just the new communication of 2020? Well, you know, coming from a guy like me, yeah, it's not thirsty at all. It's just a new way of communicating because uh, I would jump in your inbox at the drop of a dime. And with that being Please. said, my 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 percentage weight of of getting in the inbox and scoring is 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 like Michael Jordan right here. Michael Jordan, okay. I'm, like Mike. I'm scoring you like Mike, right? So, it, hey, okay. that you determined by anything. Hey, we got a new guest. We got hold on. We got a new guest just joined the show. My boy Larry from Chicago. I'm gonna run you down on the topic. The top the topic today was. A guy wrote in and said he hopped in the girl inbox. Basically, he asking us, is it thirsty for you to be hopping in inboxes of females that you don't know? Or is that just the new communication of 2020? My boy uh, Ken, it, my boy Ken was still going, so we gonna let him finish. But Ken say it ain't it ain't thirsty. And he say his 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 percentage of connecting is like Michael Jordan. So finish that off, Ken. Um I met several ladies on, on Facebook that I've actually had nice relationships with, you know? Okay. So, I, hop box, I hop in the airbox. Hey, beautiful, how you doing? So, can I take you out? Oh, uh, so okay. still, so still, just, just still the, hey, beautiful, how you doing? That still works? Oh, that definitely still works. That definitely still work. Um, hey, hey, he be in there before like, good morning, queen. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, no, no, that, 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 that's, that's probably why he on took off, bro. I'm number one right now, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm scoring right now. Hey, I know, I, I know met a nurse. And nobody nurse. else playing. I, I actually okay. mom and Lord, I, I actually wow. mom and Lord about the nurse. Okay, yeah. I, I, I know met a him. nurse. I I I done met a Cook County Correctional Officer. All mm -hmm. off the inbox. All off the inbox, man. Hey, you know what's crazy? 
Uh, sure. Actually, I want from the, is there any type of way we can, uh, I can show these facts, man, I can send these facts to one of you guys, because the nurse that Just, I met. Go, the ahead, nurse, go the, ahead and inbox it to me. And we're gonna come back to you once I get those. Let me let me Ooh. say this. Let me say this because I'm gonna let the I'm gonna let the next guy get this in. I actually met a nurse and uh after we had like our little year thing, we didn't die down. I kind of tried to pass her to my cousin. I told my cousin to shoot a shot to see what was to it, see if she was going. Mm-hmm. Was it easy? And you know, she shot him down. So I quite I I want I, I want to know, like, you know, I feel like it's just the gift of the gab, I guess. Cause she okay. shot the legendary, she shot the legendary Boo Watson down. So okay, well, well like, we, we ain't gonna we ain't gonna say Boo got shot down. Yeah, we gonna let him tell the story. We gonna move oh, on no. to my man Jeff. Hey, hey, go, hold, hey, on, hold, like, on. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just like just like on on Friday, man. Why is you in so much competition with me? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, he got he trying to be better than the one that came up before him. But we gonna move on to my boy Jeff. So, Jeff, is that just the new thing to hop in inboxes in 2020? Or or what? What you feel about though? Is it thirsty, man? It's definitely thirsty, but in a way. So tell me, do you drop in the boxes? Not no more. Not no more. <clears throat> okay. So you feel it's thirsty? Yeah. It's still okay. thirsty, but shit. To me, I don't give a fuck. I'm just be honest, be real. <laughs> I'm gonna do my thing, whatever. And see, some sometimes you get no apply. Sometimes you get apply. That's the okay. that's the new thing now, Joe. Because you uh, you ain't gonna never see these person. Some of these persons stay out of town somewhere. Hey, so so with that, so if you don't get a response, do you keep sending no. them? Or- you just no, stop. I just tried one time. If she don't, one time. she be on there. She be on there though. It, the green light be on. Okay, but okay. she don't reply. Then I just move on to the next one. Then I just oh. start liking pictures and comment on pictures and all that. Dude, that's me. So I don't give a damn stop. about so that you, either. So you saying you a serial <laughs> inboxer? No, I'm not a serial inboxer. I'm just a perfect inboxer. Perfect inboxer. Ding. All right. So my boy Boo Watson, legendary. He crossed time zones. He was in the old school and the new school. So, you know what I'm saying? Back when we needed, when no, we were call a house phone. I don't do, do the inbox that. jumping. You ain't jumping in no boxes? I don't do no inbox jumping. Like, back before when I wasn't when I wasn't in a relationship and I was single and shit, like, God damn it. You might, like Jeff said, you might like a couple pictures, hard a couple pictures or whatever the case may be. Then a the motherfucker might like a hard a couple of your shit back and then mm-hmm. you might get the notion. You might get the notion to go jump in then, but mm-hmm. just hopping in, just hopping in and not knowing that person, or you know what I'm saying, ain't even never said nothing to this person on Facebook. Your first, your first thought is to just hop in the inbox. No, that yeah. ain't cool. So soon as they send you a friend request, you hop in the inbox. That ain't cool. Okay, okay. So we know people got thousands of Facebook friends. Let's say you got a couple of Facebook friends that live out of state. How you get in contact with them if you see somebody you like? My boy Dion. Well, I ain't never had that problem. Well, you know what? I w- once I got a beeper. <laughs> <laughs> I, I ain't never had that problem. Yeah, yeah, I'll, 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 I'll thought of something, but then that 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 didn't happen. But um. <clears throat> No, man. I, I just, this is my there thing here. You know, it's the new age way of uh, dating and communicating and all of that different stuff. Like, I feel like Michael Jordan. Back in my day, I had to work hard for it. I had to grind for it. It wasn't no, it wasn't no social media, none of that stuff. You know what I'm saying? So I was out here putting in work, grinding. Headed to the mall to get some numbers. You know hey, what I'm saying? That's how we got lost. To the rest to the mall for numbers. numbers. You know, hey. it, you you had to. Hey, that was Jordan, back in the day. You, hey. you, you had to. I had to go outside, dress like something, and, hey. and get a bitch. Now, motherfuckers jump in the inboxes. They put their best picture up as the profile picture, and the motherfucker fall in love with it, bro. Hey, remember we walked blocks and blocks. That's how we connected. Hey. 
Hey, this nigga made us get on the wrong bus, Chase. This nigga make us get on the wrong bus from North Riverside chasing a bitch, goddammit. Take us all the way to LaGrange. We walked, Damn. 60, we walked 67 that miles was my, to that get was back my home. Fault I did that. Yeah, well, correct. technically, hey. we thought we thought we seen something out of the ordinary. We seen the dark skinned chick with some haze wise. So we following her and got on the wrong bus following the chick. And we look up. We in uh Lynch City out there. Damn. <laughs> Hang on, my we gotta be a bad snow. chick for y'all to be chasing. Hey, she was nice, but that walk was worse. We ain't even had no coach on there. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I want to chase her no more when she got on that damn train. Hey, Y'all bro. got on the wrong train? We got hey, bro, on the wrong about, chase bus. Hey, bro, it was about eight degrees. Snow was on the ground. I had on a little windbreaker jacket. Hey. <laughs> hey. It probably like, and, 40, it probably like hey. 40 some degrees. And, and, it wasn't no, and we ain't had no cell phone. It wasn't no navigation. So we was just hoping we was walking the right way, remember? Ooh. Damn. Hey, I knew I knew we was home when I saw the Sydney land. Hey, hey, once we got to that argument, remember, I'm like, oh, they put on the freeway right there, let's go. We walked on the freeway, remember that? Yeah. Uh, hey, a motherfucker, hey, a motherfucker ain't see a bus, a cab, a black person, nothing. <laughs> nope. nope. Damn. Hey, so that, that's how it was then, but, so, Ken, elaborate on the inbox, so, you know what I'm saying, you say you do it perfect and you got the gift of gab, so, you saying, like, any chick you see on there, you can just jump in the box, you got to over giving up the box. I'm just saying, man, I only can speak for me. Um, it worked for you. It's, it's, it's been a powerful tool for you, is basically what you're saying. Yeah, a powerful tool, man. It worked for me, man. I don't know. So, so I want to I wanna know, as well as with you doing that, do you get outside and, and then still do it the old-fashioned way? Yeah, of course. Um, of course. Yeah. Hey, Ken, you know, um, like back when me and Dion, all, all of us was coming up the same time, but we was I was before my time. So back in those days, they came up with the real rules. You know what I'm saying? They had rules against me where I couldn't even get to pay phones and stuff. You know what I'm saying? We were high, we we couldn't get to pay phones. Niggas was trying to marry every chick on the block. You know what I'm saying? They was telling teachers at the at the schools about us, trying to block us, you know what I'm saying? But me, D.I., Hugh, you know what I'm saying? That's who was in the game then. We would, we would walk. I mean, you would have thought we was the local drug dealers back then. Cause we, I mean, we stayed out. It wasn't nobody outside when we went in the house. And I'm talking about <laughs> we'd be out there till 2 o'clock in the morning. And we was like 16, nice. 15. Hey, look. Like serial killers. So, hey, look. Jumping, in the, um, jumping yeah. in the inbox, I don't think it's a bad thing. I think it's just a new way of communicating. <laughs> but... <laughs> You never know what you you can find your wife in the inbox. Who knows? Uh, uh, Jeff, so I, you just said you don't care. You gonna do what you want to do. You gonna get in inboxes, right? Do you still holler at chicks the old fashioned way? You see one walking down the street, you pull over and get her, or you hell arrest, no, bro. or you you just hell you just, no, I don't, you, I don't even do that no more. You just I don't even do you, that no more. You just inbox only. Hey nice. Jeff. Chicks don't even respect if that I no really more, do they? Wanna, if I really want it, then yeah, I, I, I try my, yeah, I will. Hey, they don't, even, they don't even respect that no more for you to walk up on them. They be hey, like, Jeff, mm, get me hey, on Jeff. Instagram with the filters. Hey, hey, Jeff, you just laughed right there. What? When he asked you, uh, do you do you ride down on chicks now or you just uh, hop in inboxes? But you know you attack. You know you attack a uh, charge up, man. You hear me try to? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, up, no, man. I don't. <laughs> no, for real though. I, if I really wanna, then yeah, I'm, I'm a um. If she shoot me down that first time, I'm not finna keep sweating them. Hey, you know the like problem I see. You know the problem I see with hopping in the inbox, and I'm so glad I'm out the game. But you know the problem I see with hopping in the inbox, because everybody paint this fabricated fairy tale on social media. Chicks got on 16 layers of makeup. Uh, they yeah, best you know wig. They best wig. Dude got the crispiest lining and got the most Beijing in his beard. You know what I'm saying? And you you inboxing these fake pictures, and then when you see him in person, it's like, this dude was 5'2". You know what I'm saying? The chick was 199 pounds. Right. Right. Like that, that picture was from six years ago. You already know how they mostly taking these pictures from this angle up here. 
You know what I'm saying? <laughs> or that one leg, that one leg out where the, where the butt look around, and then you see her shit flat as a pancake. So I don't know what y'all talking about. That chick got them men in the inbox. They real. That chick, you got in the inbox. They real, huh? Yeah, they they sell. So it wasn't no fabrication. They didn't look like they look hey. exactly how they pictures look. No, nah, for real though, exactly how they picture look. So Straight what's up. what's what's your success rate with the inbox, Jeff? Just say you inbox ten girls. Do how many how many out of them ten would give you their number? Y'all talk. Shit, be honest. Ten. Nope. Um. Uh, shit, I can't. Man, I'll be honest with you. Once I get the number, I don't even. So I don't how, I'm, just, I'm just saying, many. if if ten chicks. You inbox ten chicks. How many of them ten will give you their number? About three. Probably. Man, come on, get your. <laughs> hey, hey, Jeff. Not to cut you off. I know the percentages, and th- this ain't saying y'all ain't doing what you got to do. But I know the percentages got to be probably about probably about four or five. Yeah, I know the percentages got to be 50 percent. Because look, think of how many motherfuckers inbox you could actually get in. Back right. in the day, you weren't seeing a hundred chick. You could get in a hundred inboxes in less than right. an hour. Right. So I right. know the percentage has got to be at like forty. Hey, look. So what? What's what's your number? What's your what's your number, Doc? About six. Said, six. Oh, yeah. You get six out of ten. Yep. Hey, look. Hey, hey hold on. Hold on. Hold, hold, for, hold on for you go. What's your number, Hugh? If if you got a ten chicks inbox. Zero. 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 So back in the day, it was zero. Zero is zero forever, man. I'm gonna uh, create my girl what type of questions. Uh, 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 hey, <laughs> hold on, hold on. I got, another, I, got, I, got, I got another hard question for his ass. How did you meet your hey, girl? Tekashi. How did you meet your girl? Hey, how you meet your girl? How you meet your girl? Right. I've been to uh, <laughs> goof ass nigga. One for one on the inbox. Just lie. One for one on the inbox. Bro, hey, how you, how hey, you meet her, bro? Hey, hunk. Hey, 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 hunk. This, yeah. this, 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 this nigga cousin. I knew her. He was a part of our family. Oh. He was a part of his family. How you meet her? Uh, the question. The uh, question is. The question is how you get her. Down. Right. How you get her? Slid down on her. You slid down the inbox. Slid down the inbox. Uh, <laughs> hey, so he he shooting he shooting one hundred percent. He one for one. Hey, it's going down in the DM looking ass boy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Kid, what you saying though? Um, and you know what's crazy, right? Like I'm communicating with two females now, Mia and Linda. Both of them married. Linda oh, been man, married. Twenty. Linda been married twenty two years. So you fucking a married woman? And wait, no, you in, I just you say, in an inbox? I just, say, I just say I'm sleeping with them. I did not but say you in a married that's, woman inbox? Hey, that's against yeah, the rules. Listen. That's against the rules. Let well, me tell no, you. Yeah, let him finish. Let us redeem itself. We have <laughs> guys who... Hey, boy, chill out, man. Over there look like Elmer Foot. We have a guys who... <laughs> conversations right now. <laughs> Mia... Mia actually... <laughs> have laid... Has laid her leak down, like you know, it's it's not cool, you know, to 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 just jump in the married woman inbox. I've been married fifteen years, but you know, we still communicate. We talk every day. I'm hey, how you doing? She speak back. She not rude. She we engage, casual conversation every day. Linda, uh, that's, that's, uh, I think I think Linda. Hold on, I think Linda might want to step out. Me and Linda. Now, he had a couple of, like phone calls. I asked him one day, like your husband gone. She was like, "Hold on, he getting ready for work." And then she texted me back like twenty minutes later, like he gone. Like, what? What you want? Like, she like this is inappropriate. I'm like, can I call you? And she like, sure. We had like a fifteen minute conversation. Like for real, I'm like seriously, but it was nothing disrespectful. Like, uh, bro, bro, still this, the call right is off, disrespectful. Right off, so. right off top, right off top, that shit sounds crazy. How, yeah. Why? Why would a married woman tell you, "Okay, it's okay for you to call me," but tell you something inappropriate at the same time, bro? She's just seeing how far you're gonna go before she give you that pussy. Mm-hmm. She, hey, what's what you saying? Her name was no. Nah. 
I don't, I don't think she listen, Linda. Listen, I don't think, hey, because you go over there and dude come through that crib and kill you, you know he ain't going to jail. Nah, I don't think she going, bro, because I got on that with her and she shot me down like three times. She hey, she said, that's cool, she but on some now? real. That's cool, but on some real player shit, because she married, you should have cut off all communications with her. Like, mm -hmm. don't, you know what I'm saying? Hey, is this? Hey, is this because you married? No, <laughs> just, hey, hey, in my you, day, you, I done had some married about, chicks. He about to be married. Right. And and, and, and I done had married chicks supposedly, me, but I ain't with that. Like, I ain't finna be giving to no man wife. Hey, and then you go get married. Is it going to be cool for your girl to still talk to dudes in the box? For your wife? Boo Watson, look at him. You see how he looking? Yeah, he, he ain't got no words for that. I ain't him. Boo Watson, you ain't him. I ain't hear you. Oh, I said, I said. So you get married? You about to get married? So you get married? Is it still cool for your girl to inbox dude? What dudes inbox your girl? She talked to him as your wife. Hell no! I just got them uh, about to bust some heads about that shit a couple days ago. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so right, so and why I said and, and on some real player shit, you know what I'm saying? It's like when a when you in a married one box is cool. Once she spit that shit, I'm married. Just fall back, man. Because be even if, even if be she left her man, it'd be different. Even if instances. she left her man, right? Let's say she left her man. She got with you. Y'all got serious. You got married. You will never believe she ain't gonna do the same shit to you. Exactly. Ever. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Nah, that was for Humdunk. No, and, saying, and, I, and if us players I, don't look out, I, if us players don't look out for each other, who will? Exactly. Woman. I so, agree with him. I agree with him because no, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. I don't agree with that shit. Now you don't do no other man's wife. <laughs> no, I'm, no, I ain't saying. Well, I'm saying I agree with him when he say like she, yeah, like dude might be at work, she might be at work. You feel me? Yeah. Hey, like, look! Right now, uh, motherfuckers quarantining and being but, around, so motherfucker can see shit like that now. You know what I'm saying? And, but let know, me tell you this, this, this is what I'm like, saying, bro. If you go and you and then invited your family members, or you took four of your best friends to the courthouse, if you tell a motherfucker you married them, you do. You, ain't no more of that shit, man. Ain't no. It's over. It's ain't, over. Ain't, ain't, there, there is no inbox me. Let's be friends. Or inboxing. You know what I'm saying? There is no. You still want to get some more pussy or dick? You signed up for that one motherfucking uh, vagina and dick you got. So and and, it, and if, if 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 you hit up a woman, she married, you cool, okay, baby girl. Uh, I respect your marriage. Don't hit. Now, what you was gonna say, Ken? I'm I'm basically saying like these inboxes go lead to trouble. The conversation. Yeah. The conversation you got me in trouble. I want. I feel like. Married or not, if it was, I don't think they did not wrong because when I really tried to like get on that, they like, they like. Okay, okay. Good. Look, let me stop you right they there. Show, Let's say you, you hold down. on, hold on, Dion. Let's say you married. Let's say you married, Ken. You come home and you see your wife inbox and she been talking to a, another dude for weeks, but she ain't said nothing inappropriate. She just like he he be texting me and I message him back. How would you feel? I'm going to ask her, like, like, where is it going? Where is it leading to? No, 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 no. I want the real honest answer, my nigga. I'm giving you it to married. you, my nigga. I'm you giving married. it to you. I'm giving it to you. So you going to be, so you read all the message. You see he telling her, good morning, beautiful. And she like, hey, how you doing? But she never really crossed the line, but she, hey, how you doing? And every day he, good morning, beautiful. And she, That's hey, how you doing? That's too much right there. And I you find right out, up. and look, it's always happening the hours you gone. You only see it the hours you not at home. What you gonna do? I'm going uh, man. I'm I'm being one hundred. I'm asking like, man, where where you going with this? What is what is the purpose? Are you giving him feedback? Like like, what's up? Okay, now I'm gonna be your wife. Oh oh, it, it ain't nothing. He just texts me every day. We just cool. But you know what? That's hold on, hold on. Bud. Let him respond. Now what you say? Nip this you shit like, in the bud. Nip. Okay like, okay. I'm gonna nip it in the bud. Now two weeks later, you still find out they still text and stuff, but ain't nothing going on. And let me see your phone right quick. I'm a spaz. I'm, I'm like, let me see your phone right Bro, quick. Then I'm going to throw that motherfucker up against the wall. You, there's no Bro. way. All, I, all, look. all I'm saying now, right now is, is that. Don't do it.
look, I, I, I did all my wrong shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas trying to uh, steer yourself on the right path. I'm, I'm getting married soon, bro. I, I wish I would go into the inbox and see my wife corresponding with another motherfucker, bro. I, I wish I would go on that motherfucker and see some back and forth. And the same mm -hmm. thing go for me. I ain't gonna be no, there is no back and forth. You know what I'm saying? I don't even give a fuck if a bitch asks me for directions <laughs> after that, bro. It's over with, bitch. You hey, gotta figure it hey, out. Hey, so look, let, we go we go shoot around the court. So my man, you 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 hop Dion, I start with you. You hop in the inbox. Hey, how you doing, beautiful? Oh, I'm fine. How your day going? Oh, I'm married, sir. What do you do? I retreat. Dude, same question. So, so Dion, let me ask you this question. A yeah. young thirsty, a young thirsty nigga like me, you know, you see. Me, <laughs> don't matter how thirsty you is, you gotta have respect. For the hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let, let me finish. finish. Let, let me ask you a question. Let me yeah. ask a question. I'm gonna ask this question to you too, mom. I'm gonna keep answering it too, because you married. Now, young, a young thirsty dude like me, you steady seeing me, me, and your wife. Inbox every day. Good morning. How you doing? You know, we have a casual conversation. How was your day? You know, you see me throw little questions out there asking her for some advice. Questions basically bullshit. Guys can read between the lines. Like, yeah, the fuck he don't need no advice on this. It's bullshit. He's just trying to open the door for dialect. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What would you do? What would you do if you see me and your wife inbox and she giving me bland? Brushing me off answers in a nice way, but I'm constantly going, 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 going. What would you do? Okay, we, we already discussed this on the video where I, we uh, talked about my situation. I'm not going to be no sucker-ass nigga and go talk to the, the nigga. You know what I'm saying? Or I'm not going to be no... I'm not going to address the person that's not in my situation. You understand? Ain't, ain't no way I'm going to go talk to... Somebody that got nothing to do with my situation. I'm gonna talk to the person that I see every day on a day to day basis and let that person know how I feel. Cause there's no, you can't tell a stranger how you feel cause they mind is all, they already got a preconceived notion of what they trying to accomplish. And that's the, the, the fuck with your mate. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So that's when you mm -hmm. have a conversation with your mate and say, hey, cut this shit out or cut me out. That's it. That's all. Mm -hmm. yeah, you, I, I, hey, I agree, but on, on, on top of that, and, and, and hold on, you. and if she don't listen, I'm getting my first domestic. Hey, first of all, when you get into an establishment and you and her establish that child finna be together and, and goddamn, you finna do this for her and she finna do this for you. After that, ain't no more, ain't no more, I don't give a fuck whether it's the inbox, the motherfucking uh, regular text messages. God damn it, interacting with a motherfucker in the street ain't no more of that. You feel me? Yes. Well. Hey, hey, Come my on. boy, check it out. So look Come on. over Come here, on. over here, and I can put my wife on it now. I tell her all the time. This ain't no marriage, this ain't no relationship, this is a motherfucking business. And it's an MLM. So if you don't know what an MLM is, I want you to go research it. You gotta pay to get into that. So unless your pockets deep, homie, your inbox is gonna be on red, 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 nothing else. So mom, mom, you come home, yeah. you come home for work, you come home for work, uh -huh. and my handsome ass, you know, go to Facebook, on the Facebook, on the Facebook video call with yeah. your wife, and she ha ha ha, pumped up, you so funny. What you go, you spies, right? No, see, I ain't, <clears throat> see, it's so hypothetical that I ain't, I ain't really worried about it because I'm securing what I got going on. But let's just say, hypothetically, that happened to me. Hypothetically, because I, I ain't never been in those situations like that on no side of the, of the spectrum back in my day or now. But if, if, if my wife feels it's cool enough for you to video chatter, and right after you get done video chatting, she's going to be asking you, how many bedrooms you got in your house? Because I got to come live with you. <laughs> <laughs> Big facts. Hey, so Big unless facts. unless you can afford my wife, because you best believe, like, I'm doing a lot of shit. So 
you gonna have a hell of a bill. You are gonna be calling me to take her back. So you don't <laughs> even want the problems. Laura gonna have a Laura gonna have a eating pizza puffs and uh, <laughs> Roman noodles. Wow, so, yeah. Hey, we got some. Uh, I got. Yeah. Some, I got some well, chef, chef boy ID oodles and oodles up there. So Jeff, would you admit that you know what I'm saying from this conversation we have it? Like I can't see how you guys really in the inbox because it's a very dangerous game. But I advise you, young guys out there, because even when me, I, uh, me, Dion, and who was running the streets, because we couldn't they run the internet, be in we, they inbox. we couldn't run the internet, so we was running the streets. And we ran up on a chick, you know what I'm saying, that she was a uh, she was married or something like that. Nigga just kept moving. Hey, it ain't Shit, even I ain't never, serious, baby. Enjoy your life. You know what I'm saying? Bumping, because I ain't never bump into a girl who married like that. I won't mess with nothing like that. Because I already yeah. know what the consequences is. You don't know what type of nigga she dealing with, boy. Niggas will kill you for that shit. Hey, hey, he right. Niggas will kill you. You, you know, Dion. You, a nigga call your phone looking for me. Try to put Jeff down? Talking about he was going to kill me. Hey, hey, yeah. Hey, and this is this is another reason why I advise y'all like we look y'all in a new age of uh but you niggas ain't ain't 20 year olds either, but y'all live in a new age where y'all in the inbox, right? So imagine if you in the inbox, imagine how many niggas really in that inbox. Yeah, sure. A lot of niggas. Right. So you probably sure? Hey, hey I'm look. pretty sure. I'm pretty sure as a woman, a motherfucker as a woman, the ugliest girl probably can get about. Five to ten yeah. inboxes, five to ten inboxes a day. Right. Every day. Beyond. Cause I, cause I wake up every morning like, who am I from the inbox today? No, I ain't doing that. <laughs> so and let me ask y'all another question. So let's say, let's say, uh, so since Jeff and Ken only one in the inbox, let's say Ken, you got four hundred friends. Jeff, you got four hundred, and y'all had those same four hundred friends for about two years. Y'all done went in all the inboxes y'all could go in. How do y'all find new inboxes? Do y'all go to See, y'all? I, I request pages? new friends. Go, go so y'all go people, to y'all friends Go pages. other people's friends. No, it's like both no, of them do. I request friends. Like, it, it's like, look Where do you people. find them at? In the friend list. When Ooh, they say look for so, people. Oh, you saying those people that just pop up on there? Yeah, and I just look through it. Wow. Hey, did she look good? I'm, I'm going to request her. You know he's gonna have cyber AIDS. <laughs> they gonna have none of that, bro. <laughs> hey, hey, that that's that's crazy, world. But y'all know we always talk about the crazy shit on Three the Hard Way TV. Ain't a topic we won't discuss. So hey, I know there's a lot of niggas out there in inboxes. Like I done seen some chicks in inboxes, and I can't believe some of the shit y'all be sharing, dick pics, and and all kind of niggas showing their booties and shit. That shit is ridiculous, but. I guess the world hey, we live in now. Hey, maybe, people, maybe that's they like trying to get them. Hey, it's a girl. It's a it's a girl on my page. It's a girl on my page. I think her name like Tanika or T- Tanika Davis or some shit, bro. She posts ass pitch, pictures and say sex, sex sex shit all fucking day. So I go and read the comments and shit. You hear me? Yes. Yeah. It's 160, 130 comments every time, goddammit. And it's always some <laughs> thirsty ass motherfucker talking about some, uh, <laughs> damn, baby, right. uh, let's link. Or, you know what yeah. I'm saying? So, yeah, we know we know it's a lot of thirst trapping out there. But once again, like I said, three the hard way. We discuss all type of topics. We ain't turning it down. We're going to approach the shit that's in your mind that you scared to say. You know what I'm saying? So, a couple of us will hop in some inboxes. Some of us won't. It ain't doing no harm so far, but let us know in the comment section what you think. Is it thirsty to hop in the inbox or not? And would you, you hop ever, in the married woman inbox and keep talking to her? Have you I ever? Think, I think not, but let us know what you're saying. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that bell for notification. Through the hallway TV, we out. Hey, y'all just threw a breeze. Are you still recording, man? Shit, yeah, I thought it came All day, money, power, respect, three the hard way.